I'm Josh. I'm Liza. All right, I'm gonna steal your cell phone. What are you doing? I'm taking a picture of my junk. No. <laughs> I'm adding myself to your calendar right here next Thursday. Are you asking me on a date? Was that a yes? I don't know. Let me see that junk shot first. Oh, my God. I totally thought that was going to sound flirty, but it came out creepy. It came out really sexy, if you ask me. Well, to first times. You pay attention. I do pay attention. And for certain people, I lavish my attention. <laughs> What's so funny? Hi. I'm so sorry I passed out last night. I was just really nervous, because hey, there's something that I need to tell you. Never mind. You broke the bed. I don't think you broke your bed. I know it seems impossible. If you love him, be with him. Stop it. I Are you can't. crazy? <gasps> I think that I can maybe have another chance. I'm all about second chances. What? What? Come on. Let's give it a go. <sighs> OK. I've got to admit, I'm pretty excited. <laughs> I love you too, Josh. That's why I have to tell you, I'm a 40-year-old mom from New Jersey. Well, you're kind of a lunatic, aren't you? I, I've never felt more like the real me than I have spending these last few months with you. Where did you get that? Oh, from the hottest guy. He owns this place called, um, Inkberg? Oh my god. I did not know that that was your daughter. When I was 16, <laughs> You were... <gasps> you were 30. Yep, pretty much always a 14-year age difference. <sighs> You're closer to my mom's age than you are to mine. OK, can we stop uh, doing the math now? Yes. You're not a millennial. Yeah, well, Dr. Dre is not a doctor. I want to live an authentic life. It, it's, it, that's just who I am. Thank you for keeping my secret. Yeah, well, some secrets are worth keeping. If we're going to have this relationship, we have to talk. We can't hide from everything. I guess I kind of do worry that this has an expiration date. I don't know what our future holds, but I know I don't want to bail on this. This magazine wants me to be in their Young Creatives issue. Oh, that's great. Oh, Congrats. What's it's the magazine? T Magazine. Josh. You're going to be in the New York Times? Do you want to come interrupt me when I say dumb stuff? They have fact checkers, people whose entire job it is to pry into your record and dig up every single mundane thing. And the more I talk to Greta, the more I realize how big a part of my story you actually are. Aw. I can't be in your life. You can't be in my life. Not yet. When? I can't do this anymore. Josh. I missed you. I missed you too. I want to be with you. Whatever that means, I'm all in. Hey, I thought hey. you wanted to, you know, Netflix and chill tonight. Yeah, babe. You know that means sex, right? <laughs> well, no, 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 no. I'm not here. Why? Why not? Why? Because this is my boss's house. That's why. <laughs> that's exactly why it's so hot. <laughs> OK, we can't. Ooh. Babe, your away game is just it's, it's a little weak right now. That's all. all right, you know what? Mm. Back in the day, I did it on a park slide and once in a big boy drive-in. My back in the day is happening right now. And I'm going to need stories to tell the 26-year-old that I'm going to date when I'm bored. So I, just... <laughs> I wouldn't want you to regret jumping into this relationship too soon after your marriage. I could never regret you. When you think about it, this whole time we've been kind of committing adultery. I hope I still find you attractive now that you're not my, what's the male equivalent to mistress? Uh, how about side piece? Oh, I like that. 
I love it. It's us. It's when we're together, it's like time has stopped. Things are good, right? Yeah. Yeah. Things are good. I love you. I, I really love you. A digital pregnancy test? Yeah, the lady said it was the best one. This says I have to download an app. What do you like, pee on your phone? I can't stop thinking about it. I thought we talked about this. I never thought I'd be talking about kids yet. You know? Oh, I never thought I'd meet somebody like you either. I think she's the one. The one? Why and I are supposed to be together. I just really don't want to lose her, Max. You don't. You are everything to me. But you're a liar and a cheater. And whether you realize it or not, your lies are hurting everyone around you. Josh. Hey, I saw you see me. I need to make a clean break from Liza and her entire world, OK? I mean, I'm sure you know by now what's going on with us. I know everything. You know everything? Who is she? Hmm. Like, do I even know her at all? It's like you know her and you don't. So what really went on that night uh, when you were planning to propose? Hmm. We can be friends. Don't ask me about that night. Ever again. Yeah! See why you wanted to get coffee here. Yeah, she works for me part time. She's hot. If you like straight girls with sexy hair, it's kind of my thing. I'm sorry how it went down with Liza. You mean how I caught her cheating on me? I mean, you were way more than she bargained for. If someone tells you they're a liar, you should believe them. Well, why'd you have to kiss him? Some part of me needed to blow things up. <sighs> Just please tell me that you'll be in my life. Please, somehow. There's got to be a better ending to us than this. House boy, reporting for duty. Oh, the creeping kills? What? Yeah. God, a vein much? <laughs> you guys got to come inside and see this. Are you ready for this? They're everywhere. What? Dicks. Ah, oh, my God. The doorknobs are knobs. Maybe we should pick each other's Tinder dates. I bet I could do better than you. I know I could do better than you. Give me your phone. I got a better idea. Live Tinder. What is live Tinder? It's a bar. Josh, this is Claire. Claire, this is Josh. <laughs> Starting to feel like everyone's just out for themselves. I'm glad you're here. I am going to take you on a proper date. And I look forward to it. Your lips are spicy. Should we stop? No. I kind of like it. Ooh. What's wrong? Oh, my dick is on fire. Jalapeno dick? Oh, just... oh. That'll do it. I bet this is the uh, best first date you've ever had, huh? Oh, by far. <laughs> the only way we can keep dating is if I marry her. What, you're going to marry Claire? I kind of need you, Liza. Say to Nahili. It's you, Liza. It's always been you. Please, I can't give you the life that you no, want. The life that I want is any life with you. I keep coming back to you. I know. I should move on. I need to put a ring between us. Truth is, we didn't have the greatest time on our honeymoon. She just couldn't lie anymore. I just keep putting myself out there for people, and I just keep getting kicked in the face. I... It's OK. Everything's going to be OK. I need to break this pattern. All right, I, I want to be the guy that's into random hookups, not the guy that just keeps falling in love with everyone. Josh, that is like me saying I want to be athletic, OK? I'm serious. You're a born romantic, dude. I might not always be the same person in your life, but I will always be in your life. <laughs> I'm not ready to give up yet. <gasps> hey, Claire. For the first time, everything seemed real, and I knew I had to tell you. Wow. This kid is so lucky to have you as a dad. I think the baby's coming. Now? Now. I mean, like, right now. Oh, my God! Lauren, Gemma is following me on Insta. Mm -hmm. She has 5,000 followers? You're welcome, Peach. 
Josh? What are you two doing at a psychedelics retreat? Cheers. Cheers. I know you're with him, but I'm glad we can still spend time together like this. <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> so, how did this happen, Josh? She was smart and sexy. I wouldn't believe anything that she said. I just wanted to keep talking to her. I fight to keep people in my life. I just don't know if it's the best thing to do anymore. No matter how much you love someone, it doesn't mean they stick around. It doesn't mean that you're what's best for them. You're scared of us, scared of what we were, of what we still are. Don't you tell me what I feel. Say you love him more than you love me. Is that what you need to hear? I know when you're lying. Especially to yourself. You know that tattoo I gave you? Yes. <laughs> well, they want to license it. You know, they want to promote it and put it on every single person that wants to get it tattooed. I don't know, I figured I should ask you first to see if that was okay. If it's all the same to you, that tattoo is... It's, it's ours. It's mine. I wouldn't want anyone else to have it. Is that okay? Yeah. Yeah. That's great. I'll see you around. Okay. It brings me joy to know that you are happy. Josh, you are so special to me. I always want you in my life. You promised me that. Yeah. I want you in mine, too. Always. Forever. Relationships don't have to be defined. Thank you. Thank you for helping me. Always. If I would have told you sooner, would it have made a difference? Maybe. You broke up with Claire pretty easily. Now you plan on being a little more careful with Kels, yeah? Sorry, I didn't see you there. Really? Because you know what? I've been right here by your side. All alone. <laughs> <laughs>